uh, bashing a biker and drubbing a driver. Plus, pushing for prayer. With all that alliteration, mm, must be time for Tell It to Tim. A biker run off the road by a cranky old man. Yes, the motorcyclist did illegally pass the car. Did he throw the book at that old man? Throw him in jail? Put him in a psych ward? Something, because there's something wrong with him. The victim of the motorcycle accident, he wants to talk about making it safer for motorcycles. How about you follow the rules on the street? You weren't trying to pass the guy, you would never got hit. And I have many times wanted to do exactly what that man did. We'll let the courts sort out this one and keep you posted. The Irving teenager, Ahmed the Clockmaker, traveled to the White House. Now, he and his family are moving to Qatar. Ahmad Muhammad and his family have decided to move to the Middle East. Yay! Good riddance. Why is he at the White House when there's so many kids out there that have really done something that aren't there? I am so tired of seeing the little boy that built the clock that looks like a bum being glorified. The sentiment from many of you. Let's just move on from this one. A high school coach near Seattle defied orders to stop praying on the field. I don't think there's anything wrong with that coach having prayer after a football game. I just hope and pray for him and that he will keep his job. Lawyers for the coach say he agreed not to lead prayers but will not give up his right to pray along with the kids. And finally... Oh, I'll go ahead. You, you go right ahead. Kim Kardashian celebrating a birthday today. I know you won't say her name. Well, he won't, I won't even say guess. her age. She's not a celebrity. Yeah, oh. he won't even guess. Thank you for taking a stand against the media machine that's vaulted this pack of nitwits to undeserved fame and notoriety. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. And you can tell it to Tim at 214. Believe me, it's my pleasure. 214-468-7447. Go to the Good Day page of foxfornews.com to send an email.